Hello everyone, so let's talk about some shit. And recently, according to this article on ExtremeTech.com, box copies of Titanfall 2 will not have physical media inside of them. Now, this is something that I personally find as a pet peeve of mine. I, re I bought a copy on PS4 of uh, Tomb Raider and Temple of Osiris, and a before even walking out of the goddamn store, I looked on there and saw no game disc included download only. And the thing was I already owned a, it on, in my library, I wanted a physical copy of the game. So I turned right around and I refunded that shit right away. Uh, but I'm pretty sure I'm not the only one that doesn't see the point of having a physical copy of the game. If it's not a physical copy of the game, there's no disc inside of it, it's just a case. Just sell the case, goddammit. But here, here's the uh, official, official uh, PC cover. And we'll read a little bit out of this article here. See, it says the PC market is largely moved to digital sales thanks in part to the aggressive downsizing from change from chain stores like GameStop over the last decade, and partly because online PC gaming has been baked in for 20 years. Now, there's just a lot of perks to owning things digitally. You can have it installed ready to play the moment it releases. You don't have to switch out discs. You don't have to find room for your, your physical library. Any, any range of reasons for this um but here's what you should have done you should have made it a digital only release and only charge 40 dollars for it I, I at least don't think that's too much to ask for um at least the last titanfall felt like a 40 dollar game to me but we'll continue in there are however still people who like buying a game on physical media and prefer having cd or disc within games content rather than relying on digital service and there's a lot of perks to that too because suppose the the online servers go down, or suppose you you don't have connection to the internet, you just want to take it out to a place where you don't have internet and you want to play for the night, you know, things like that. I, I don't like relying on the internet myself. I, I like having the digital copies, preferably, but I see that they're both equally, you know, there's an argument to, make, to be made for each and a preference depending on the person. In recent years, we've seen a trend where game developers don't bother putting an entire game on disc, instead relying on the end user to download them from a secondary server. Now Titanfall is simply getting rid of physical media entirely. If you buy the physically box game, all you get is a code in the box, no disc, no nothing. A leaked copy of the Titanfall 2 box shows the game with a prominent download-only, no disc included sticker, as you can see below. Now at least they were nice enough to do this. Uh, they did The game that I bought also had something similar, it was written in very small text on the bottom, but it was still there, to give me that, hey, I don't want this, this isn't what I wanted, so I, I was able to to take it in. And then also, internet connection requir required for product activation, you know, that seems pretty self-explanatory. Uh, there are several ways to look at this, on one hand, box copies of games are a dying breed. You know, I, I think we can probably come to our own conclusions on the rest of this. I, I'm not gonna, I usually read the whole, whole article, but basically, you got, uh, On one hand, you can have things on a physical media, and say that physical media gets scratched up, that disc, it's n it's no good. I, I think games should be put on very, very cheap USBs, possibly, and then sold dirt cheap. Like, oh, well, you can't justify the cost of this game if it makes only costs only $5 to produce a physical copy. Like, I understand the game development still need a decent amount of money, but that should, you know, lower the cost of actual distribution, I would imagine. Um, on the other hand, I, I do think there should be a discount for digital media because the incentive isn't just quite enough. You're still not getting the instruction manual. Like I like having all of those things. In fact, I have uh, a couple of indie boxes and a few other things. Uh, I like having that instruction manual and being able to look through it like you did when I was a kid. But I don't know, maybe times are changing. But I, I personally don't like this idea like just if you're gonna sell it physically put a fucking disc in it and it pisses it, it honestly it it, it it pisses me off if you, I, I mean they are nice enough i will say this much to put this but fuck them for selling this in stores like do they need the promotion from seeing the box in gamestop enough to they need to produce a bunch of empty cartridges that seems really stupid so that's pretty much all I had to say on that, but I wanted to say something anyway. So thanks everyone for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any comments, think something you'd like to add to the discussion, feel free to comment below. I'll be checking out the comments every now and again. But my name is Everjet. I do some gaming news every now and again. And if you like this sort of thing, maybe subscribe and uh, check more of it out in the future. So I'll see you guys later.